Hey folks, how's it going? So, before this reset, I've managed to level up Jing Liu properly, still missing a couple of skill points, but should be more than fine like this, and I wanted to give her a proper shot. Second team should be more than fine with Kafka and Sampo. I've been farming a lot of relics for my supports, and even though they're not perfect, should be good enough. One thing I really want to go back to farm at this point would be the relics for MC. The throtters this time around have been pretty cool too. Last rotation they dealt damage, this time they only apply vulnerability, but they can apply up to two stacks, so starting with these, probably a good idea. Get the weakness breakdown for the extra effect on the light cone, and then we nuke. She has three relics that really need replacing, but still, that damage, awesome. ハッ。避けられない一石データ収集捕獲マーク起動。愉快な反撃の時間です。我に力を逃げられるぞ。逃げるか。まだ立ち上がりますか記録開始。深呼吸。適切なエンジョだった。<笑><笑> Now, there's a pretty big debate on whether a fast or a small Bronya could be the best support for her, but considering that I still have a slow Sele as well and I would like to use Bronya in both teams, I think I might try to keep her fast anyway. A slow one would be better for a zero cycle, at least to buff up Jing Liu on turn one. But considering that at this point they have over 40 speed difference, I think I might want to keep her on the fast set too. まだ立ち上がりますか。ドン。我々は塔に嵐に踏み入った守るべき者のために打ち崩せ。深呼吸。適切なエンジンだった。遠くに行く。手段は選ばない。Choices, choices, but I think they should be done. The moment Bronya gets her own turn, the first half is over. She's way too good. She's about as good as she is pretty, and at this point I'm just head over heels for her. <laughs> Second half is going to be a little bit slower since I can't really run Asta in here and Kafka only has 125 speed. I'm going to need to farm a few more relics for her but I've got a few too many projects I'm currently working on so that's going to have to wait. Likely until after Topets. <laughs> Oh, 
やり先に火を炎のエリオ断ち切れ僕は友情を重んじるタイプなんだ<笑>期待しちゃったお客様を裏切れと<笑>追加料金ですよ<笑>全員死刑素晴らしい時はさようなら<笑><笑>ダンス戦闘準備落ち着いて。ハハッハッ。素晴らしい時はさようなら痛くないわ直してやろうかトリア立ちなさい大しちゃっお客様を裏切れと<笑>追加料金ですよ私が守るやり先に火を炎のエリオ断ち切れ僕は友情を重んじるタイプなんではい<笑>チャンスだよ<笑>全員死刑<笑>素晴らしいとさようなら<笑>新しい商売ですか立ちなさい。開けよあら、優しいのね。さあ。こ、うん、の。見せてやろう。ひょうたんの薬よ。あら、優しいのね。<笑><笑>お客様を裏切れと<笑>追加料金ですよやり先に火を炎のエリオ断ち切れ<笑>素晴らしい時さようなら<笑>無事なのもしないわ<笑>よっ<笑>これ新しい商売ですかフッ<笑>私が守る落ち着いて悪を払う<笑>つまらないね<笑>よいしょ<笑>はい<笑>全員死刑<笑>素晴らしいさようなら<笑>ダンス戦闘準備立ちなさい見せてやろう教官の薬よトリア<笑>期
返しちゃってますお客様を裏切れと<笑>追加料金ですよ天下無敵呼吸するその感覚覚えておいて<笑>チャンスだよ落ち着いて直してやろうかよいしょ僕は友情を重んじるタイプはい私が守る、うん、新しい商売ですか<笑>悪を払うこの程度見せてやろう巨漢の薬よあら優しい<笑>全員死刑<笑>直してやろうかよいしょいや落ち着いて期待しちゃってお客様を裏切れと<笑>追加料金ですよダンス戦闘準備あっ無事なのかくないわつまらないねそうな<笑>弱っておるのトリア立ちなさい And we even get to close with style. Overall, it felt like a p r e v i o u s rotation. Now, we're going to have to wait and see what comes out tomorrow. So, for Jing Liu, we're still in the first week of progression. 36% crit rate is a little bit too low, and she still needs about 1 million credits in order to max out her skills. Gear wise, gloves, chest, and boots would need to be replaced, even though I'm pretty happy with the secondary set. Bronya did get her light cone, but this is also something you can just buy if you roll enough, so eventually it should be free to play available as well. For her gear, I tried to put anything that had speed and crit damage on it, even though 142 speed still feels very, very slow. Lynx ended up stealing everything that was on Natasha, and she too only has her traces up to level 8. The 8 to 10 grind is honestly a bit heavy. It also took me 90 rolls for a single copy, so no Eidolons in here. Pela at least has been doing okay. 56% hit rate, 150 speed, sort of acceptable. Her traces still stuck at level 8 though. For the relic set, it's just been speed and effect hit rate, even though she somehow got a lot of crit too. Also, she is my one and only E6 4 star. Like mentioned before, Kafka down at 125 speed is not really optimal. She will need at least 9 more. It's just that I don't really want to go back and farm for more relics at this point. She's been doing okay and as long as they can keep on clearing Memory of Chaos 10, I think I can work on something else. Sampo for some reason has been on 2 banners on Raid Up but is still locked at E2. And as a 4 star support, I'm afraid I haven't really been focusing on building him up to his maximum potential. He still does his job properly though. Now, Bailu was a pretty lucky pick. I really like the way she heals, and the 85% effect resistance kind of saves her from a lot of debuffs. She needs more traces and, like everything else, more speed. A lot more speed.
last in the list is Stell, and that's another character I really need to farm more relics for, but that's going to happen while I try to fix up Kefka and possibly Jing Yuan. Somehow she ended up getting a lot of crit stats and her chest and boots have to be swapped between her and March 7th, which is something I can't wait until I have to stop doing it. Alright then, I guess that's it for the clear this time around. Let me know how things have been going for you and if you guys have been enjoying Jingyu as well. Until the next time, ciao!